Hey, new family, we're back again with another collab by Mama Dares to DIY and Sweet Urban Rose. In this collab, we've been challenged to either nail, <laughs> meaning that we have to go ahead and make sure that this DIY is similar to the dupe, or it can be a fail. So I want you to let me know down in the comments below whether or not I nailed or failed this DIY. Let's hop right into it. So I have a lamp that I had on hand that needed some upcycling. So I grabbed it and started my DIY. I'm gonna go ahead and take everything apart and then we're gonna get started right into this DIY. Now that the chandelier is disassembled, uh, you can see where I've already spray painted the hardware black to match with our dupe that we're attempting to recreate. Now, if you're like me and you're not going out due to the current events, I decided to go ahead and take some aluminum foil to makeshift as my iron that's going on our piece today. So we'll just grab our pieces, take them outside, and spray paint them all black. I noticed a few pieces were not covered in black on the chandelier, so I decided to go ahead and touch them up inside. Let's go ahead and grab some picture frames, disassemble them, and we're gonna use them as our wooden parts for our chandelier. Now we're gonna use these pieces as our connectors for the top and bottom of our chandelier. We're gonna cut them down to size and then wood glue them and nail them into place. Now we're gonna go ahead and wood glue our brace in place for the top of our chandelier. Here we're gonna go ahead and clamp it into place so that it is secure and allow some time to dry. Now that that's drying, we're gonna go ahead and give our base coat of paint of a light gray that I have here on hand. As you can see here, I'm not attempting to cover all the pieces. I am leaving some of the wood to show through. So we're gonna give it some drying time after completing everything, and then we're gonna move to our next step. 
And now that it's all dry, we're gonna apply some crackle medium. You want to make sure you get the medium in all areas and then we're going to just set this aside and allow for it to dry for one hour in between coats. And next we're going to go ahead and apply our top coat for the crackle finish. And you want to make sure that you apply it in one direction and do not paint over what you've already applied paint to. Allow for it to dry and then you will start to see the crackle finish as such here. And now we're gonna go ahead and hang our chandelier. <laughs> this is the fun part, guys. And if you notice, I only applied one bar because it was easier to do it that way in order to get it hung up correctly without a struggle. Now to secure our brace, we're going to go ahead and use some clamps to hold it down after applying wood glue. And next we're going to use our metal pieces to go ahead and create the X design.
So now that we're all finished, I want you guys to tell me down below in the comments whether or not I nailed or failed this design.